Hello, Diana. Director Frederick, good evening. We had a small incident. A display case holding exhibits and a window were broken. Luckily, the alarm system worked, and nothing seems to be missing. Looks like it was just some vandals making trouble. That display held my exhibits. I'd better check to see if everything is really in place. What did the guard say? Well, uh, David seems to have disappeared. And the strangest thing is that the monitoring cameras didn't record anything. Can you imagine? It's all noise. I must arrange the exhibits in their spots. The exhibition is new, and I don't remember exactly where each item was. Oh, the archive in the security computer should have a photo. Each museum exhibit is equipped with a GPS transmitter. If I enter the exhibit's code, the device will show its location. There. Luckily, each artifact should have a GPS transmitter. I can try to track the signal using the guard's tablet. According to the map, the item is somewhere on an abandoned lot, not far from the museum. was David, the guard. What's going on with him? Why did he throw the exhibit into the well? I'll try to retrieve the bus now, and I'll talk to David later.
many golden items. They all must be stolen. I need to get out of here and report what I've found. another world yet again how can i activate the portal i want to return as soon as i can well hello anyone here Who are you, stranger? 
My name's Diana. I came here through an ancient portal somehow, and appeared at the entrance to this temple. Oh dear, this is no temple. It's a dungeon. And before us, you can see the terrible demon, Ritoris. He can't be killed, so he needs to be locked up. Thanks to my magic powers and my willingness to sacrifice my freedom, I've been keeping him asleep for decades now. My name is Keytron. As for you, well, it won't be easy to return home, Diana, but it's doable. Oh, that's good to hear. Yes, but I cannot leave this place. I'm old and weak, and all my strength goes to sustaining Retorus in a deep sleep. I used to have an assistant, but he vanished a couple of days ago. I'm dying of thirst. Could you bring me some water? I'll think of how to help you get back home quickly. Thank you, my dear. A few more days and I would have died of thirst. Now, listen. To activate the portal again, and thus open yourself a way home, we'll need a special crystal. A pink quartz. Not far from this complex, you find a crypt for the wizards of an ancient tribe. Only they kept the crystal you need. Find it and return to me. Then I'll tell you what you must do next. Thanks for the help. I'll be back soon. One more thing. The passage to the tribe settlement is protected by a special field. You didn't notice it. Deactivate it first. You'll need a key to do that. Here, take it. I bet something important is hidden beyond this field, but how can I turn it off?
This is the crypt of the great tribe of wizards. What brings you here? I came to find the pink quartz. Are you a ghost? I am the ghost of the High Wizard. One day, we were struck by some strange ailment. And within just a few days, every member of the tribe perished. Everyone. I was no exception. But my spirit remained bound within these solitary places. Is there a special ritual which could help you return to your people? Indeed there is. Just like the bodies of all the resting High Wizards, mine also needs to be buried in a special way. Help me. In return, you will learn the secret of retrieving the Pink Quartz. Let's go to the Ritual Temple. But you need to cross the precipice somehow. There is the vault where my body lies. First, you... And this is the Ritual Temple. Before you enter, deactivate the trap. The sarcophagus with my body is up there. Lower it, and then open it.
This is blood water. We need it for the ritual. Without the fire powder, the ritual won't work. There it is. My mummified heart is stored in this altar. We'll need it for the ritual. You need to place three figurines there in order to take it out. Finally, I am free. I remember, I gave my word that I would help you. Look at the skull. After you place it next to the skulls of my ancestors, the combined power of our knowledge will create the crystal you need. Farewell.
Ha 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 ha! People, you're all such naive creatures. This complex, my dear, was indeed once a dungeon. My prison! I was locked here for centuries, slowly draining powers from half-dead Retorus. Let us pay him respect. He fought to the very end, but now this crystal will transfer all his life force to my veins till the last drop. I will be invincible at last. Hey, are you all right? Lucky you. Good thing I noticed when you fell into the water. I rushed to help you right away. I'm Diana. And you are? I'm a local trader, name of Lochter. I've just come from the next village. Wait, that temple is a forbidden place. When I was a kid, they told me a terrible demon had been chained there. How did you get inside? By pure coincidence. Lochter, I thought I was helping an old man in that temple. But it turned out, it looks like I've released a horrible demon. What have I done? Yeah, we haven't seen anything like this in our lands for a long time. We're in front of the house of the village elder, and he's an old friend of mine. Tell him everything from the beginning. He might give you some advice. The elder's house is to the right. I hope he's home. Oh, no. Ketron free. Be stopped. He, he must be stopped. Poor soul. He's delirious. No, he's in a trance. The Elder can enter a special state to see the past, and sometimes the future. Lochter, is that you? Find the sorceress and bring me back. I went too far. He must have entered a very deep trance. We need to help him return. He mentioned a sorceress. Yes, I've heard of her. Let's go, Diana. There's a risk the Elder will stay on the other side. The sorceress lives in the deep forest, so let's head out, quickly. That must be the sorceress's place. How can we get across the swamp?
Good day. Are you the sorceress? The Elder sent us. He's been trapped. He entered a trance, and now he can't return to his senses. That old fool. I warned him it might end up like this. Only one potion can bring him back. I'll start to brew it, but I'll need your help. Did you see a bird in the Elder's house? Bring it to me. I'll need it. Back already, huh? Excellent. Now, all we're missing is bat claws. This bird will help me catch a bat. I'm going hunting, and you finish the rest. But, but how will we know what to- Don't fret, my dear. The recipe is on the table.
I see you did well. Add the bat claw and hurry to help the elder. I'm back. Now I know what happened to you. You're naive. You didn't know who you were helping. Listen now. The old man you saved is named Kitron. He's one of the invaders, the Tohunga, who came here through the Forbidden Gates, just like you did. Long ago, two brothers, Kitron and Ravu, were traveling the worlds, using up their natural resources and subduing the local people. They turned their attention to the gold on our planet, which they used to prolong their lives, though not indefinitely. As time passed, Ravu's attitude toward the planet's residents began to change. He fell in love with a common woman, and soon after, she gave birth to their son. That young lad possessed the best features of both his father and mother, and it was obvious he was not some unremarkable half-breed. Catron, however, insisted on receiving the resources he felt he was owed. The conflict between the brothers heated up until one day Catron, the traitor, killed his brother. The fate of Ravu's son, Ritoris, was to be the same. But Ketron discovered that Ritoris's life force was so strong, it was capable of prolonging Ketron's life for centuries, just like gold. You need to go to Rocktown, and quickly. Its people built a trap for Ketron once. In my visions, I saw that help will come from them. Take the horses to travel faster. No! The road is blocked and we can't get through. Look, Diana. A gate. A road to the town must lie beyond it. Oh no. Lockter fell into the tunnel and got trapped. How can I set him free?
caves make a real Lockdoor fell into a troll's trap. How can I get him out? There are stalactites hanging right over the troll. I need a way to bring them down on him. You've been a big help, Diana. Thank you. I've been busy too. Look, I stole a key from the troll. That's Rocktown. Hmm. Looks like it's a bad.
Welcome. I haven't seen strangers in our lands for some time now. We've come for help. We were- Oh, I know what's going on. I saw that you were chased. Looked like the same kind of golem Katron used to create to threaten our people. We need to destroy it right away. But how? You'll need a special seed. It'll grow inside that monster and break it to pieces. Take this detail. A lock that blocks the passage to the seed warehouse is missing it.
damaged! But why have you brought danger to our lands? Diana came to us by accident, straight from another world. It turned out she helped Kitron, without being aware of who he was. The elder of the Carfu tribe sent us to you. He said your people are the only ones who can help us. And now you bring us your misfortune. It was because we were unable to withstand Kitron's mental powers that we came here long ago to live underwater. Katran was forcing our people to bring gold to his temple, using only the power of his mind. The gold prolonged his life in some unknown way. That's why David, the guard, stole the golden bust. Well, I guess I need to bring you to Her Highness, but without the key to the tunnel gate, we won't get into our world. There's the submarine. Let's lower it into the water to take it to the underwater city. But first we'll need to fix the propeller which got damaged as I was arriving from town. No worries though, everything's ready in the workshop. I'm already aware of who you are and what trouble you've caused. Listen carefully. We need to act fast. If Kitran absorbs all the strength of his nephew, we won't be able to defeat him. 
Long ago, our ancestors built the temple where these two remained chained to each other for so many years. Back then, we and the other tribes were still in Kitron's power, but we were not happy with that arrangement. It wasn't easy, but thanks to our cunning and a dose of luck, we managed to lead that evil into a trap and seal the sarcophagus. And now, the only way to stop him is to open the sealed sarcophagus, wake up Ritorus, and reverse the horrible process. Our head scientist Morgius will create the special stamp you need to remove the seal from the sarcophagus. The complex where the seal was created lies beyond this door. It was built only for that purpose, and has been abandoned for a long time now. Let's try to run the machinery. But as you can see, the complex is flooded. Just look at this machinery! Electric plankton used to swim in its spheres. They were supposed to generate the power needed to create the stamp. That's strange, but the plankton are still here, and all the spheres except for one. We must fill it up. This is a pool for breeding plankton. Maybe we can take some plankton right from it.
Excellent. You managed to charge the stamp. Now you can open the sarcophagus to release Ritoris. Hurry. Time is of the essence. You'd better enter the temple from the other side. Go through the secret tunnel our ancestors used. This detail will open the passage to the tunnel. We need to go up to the complex. Thank you.